The jury is going to deliver their verdicts on the three right, charges. Please be seated. Members of the jury, I understand you have a verdict. Members of the jury, I will now read the verdicts as they will appear in the permanent records of the 4th Judicial District. State of Minnesota, County of Hennepin, District Court, 4th Judicial District. State of Minnesota Plaintiff versus Derek Michael Chauvin, Defendant. Verdict, Count 1. Court File Number 27, CR 20-12646. We, the jury, in the above entitled matter as to Count 1, unintentional second degree murder while committing a felony, find the defendant guilty. This verdict agreed to this 20th day of April, 2021, at 1.44 p.m. Signed, juror four person, juror number 19. Same caption, verdict count two. We, the jury, in the above entitled matter as to count two, third degree murder, perpetrating an eminently dangerous act, find the defendant guilty. This verdict agreed to this 20th day of April, 2021, at 1.45 p.m. Signed by jury four person, juror number 19. Same caption, verdict count three. We, the jury, in the above entitled matter as to count three, second degree manslaughter, culpable negligence, creating an unreasonable risk, find the defendant guilty. This verdict agreed to this 20th day of April, 2021, at 1.45 p.m. Jury four person, 019. Members of the jury, I'm now going to ask you individually if these are your true and correct verdicts. Please respond yes or no. Juror number two, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number nine, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 19, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 27, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 44, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 52, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 55, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 79, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 85, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 89, is this your, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 91, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Juror number 92, are these your true and correct verdicts? Yes. Are these your verdicts, so say you one, so say you all? Yes. 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 Members of the jury, I find that uh, the verdicts as read reflect the will of the jury and will be filed accordingly. Yes! I have to thank you on behalf of the people of the state of Minnesota All three! for having jury service, but heavy duty jury service. What I'm going to ask you to do now is to follow the deputy back into your usual room, and I will join you in a few minutes to answer questions. Look at the face of a man who has never so, been made to experience the, the consequences of his actions before. Be seated. With the guilty verdicts returned, we're going to have uh, Blakely, you may file a uh, written argument as to Blakely factors within one week. The court will issue findings on the Blakely factors, the factual findings, one week after that. We'll order a PSI immediately returnable in four weeks. And we will also have a briefing on, after you get the PSI, Six Meanwhile, we'll get you the exact dates. Uh, 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 Goodbye. Farewell. Rewind to when they first announced the crowd. Yeah, what do we go back? Two minutes?
Three charges. Second degree unintentional murder, third degree murder, and manslaughter. Which was about as much justice as we could expect to get within the purview of this court case. Uh, I hope that Derek Chauvin gets fucked. He was a bad cop and a bad person. I don't care about him. In a country where countless innocents have been locked up for damn near their entire lives for negligent offenses, uh, George uh, Floyd's death is something which I think more than more than deserves the book being thrown at Chauvin. The th expression on his face, that panic when the guilty verdicts were delivered, like a man who's never really been made accountable for the actions he's taken. <sighs> yeah, bring the wine, Aina. He looks confused. Bring the wine, absolutely. And a glass, please. <sighs> this is a pivotal trial. You know, the, um... My parents were in L.A. back during the Rodney King trial and the riots which ensued afterwards. And, um, you know, they mention it from time to time. And uh, the Rodney King trial was an unmistakable and undeniable um, uh, uh, just travesty of justice. And um, it did tremendous damage to the community. <laughs> what the fuck? Did the jury not even watch the Steven Crowder video? Dude, wait, I'm sorry. Can we get a retrial? Hold on. I'm sorry. Have did, Were the jurors not even presented Ben Shapiro's show episode 1762, where he debunks all of the claims against Derek Shai? <laughs> okay. All right. I, a justice system, I guess. Oh, man. Get fucked. Vosh, this isn't justice, this is basic accountability. It is, in this instance, both. But justice is not solution, unfortunately. Justice does not fix these problems. It doesn't change any of the institutions that led us to this position. It doesn't do that. It doesn't undo all the pre-existing systems. Now, please keep in mind, okay? Please keep in mind, this would not have happened if it weren't for your anger. By your anger, I mean, I guess, Americans' anger, not necessarily you people specifically. When was Derek Chauvin charged? How long did it take in between George Floyd's murder? We can say murder because Chauvin has been convicted for murder now. How nice is that? It's a technical legal term now. It's not just a, it's not just a flourish. You can just say it. How nice is that? Public outrage is what drives people like Derek Chauvin to accountability. Okay? Chauvin in cuffs? <sighs> give it to me. Ooh, give it to me. Yes! Ugh. Hey, hey. Oh, just, uh, yeah, just a cup. Thank you. All right. Absolutely. You can bring the bottle. Ah. Oh, Christ. <sighs> this doesn't fix any of the institutional problems that led up to this point. It doesn't. It doesn't actually fix any of them problems. There is, however, one very real injustice that has been corrected today, okay? One very, very real. Wait, what is this tweet? Hold on. CNN's Don Lemon, justice has been served, and we all know he would have never said this had the reverse verdict been reached. Yeah? Y yeah? What? Boy, boy genius, by the way. I take everything I was about to say back. 
The real justice that's been served today is that conservatives are angry. There's really nothing beyond that, okay? If, if there's anything that we can take tremendous emotional, borderline sexual pleasure from, it's their molding, okay? Nothing can bring George Floyd back. And nobody but us, progressive Americans, can ensure these systems are changed so this doesn't happen in the future. That responsibility lies entirely upon us. Today, the 420 miracle, all three guilty charges. It feels like a um, bit of a history rewrite from the Rodney King trial. Everything my parents told me about it. All the insane shit that happened back then. There's still going to be civil unrest following this. And there's still going to be a lot of conflict. And that's probably going to continue to be the case for decades and for centuries. And maybe forever after this point. But this was the best outcome today. Today, we won. And hopefully this gives us some momentum. Because without the outrage that was generated by George Floyd's death and the public outcry that it got, this wouldn't have happened. It would not have. And our outrage, the next time this happens, and the next and the next, hopefully continues that pattern. Hello. Chef, my younger brother. Chauvin has had his bail revoked? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Well. You know. Sometimes you have the good days, right, folks? I'm go God, I'm going to be debating this trial for the next year of my life, at least. Oh, yeah, the next year of my life. I'm going to be talking to people, conservatives. They're going to be, yeah, this is a travesty of justice. You know? It'll be good. It'll be good. There's nothing they can say to make themselves any less mad. Oh, yeah, Paul is having an absolute meltdown right now. Oh, my God, I can't even read. It's all N-words. Holy shit. Whoo! Oh, they're mad. Oh, my God, they're mad. Oh, God, I can't even imagine being that mad at justice.